Good morning. When my wife Peggy and I moved to Greenville about 16 years ago and began looking for a church, our criteria were few. We were Presbyterian, so that was probably pretty important. It was important that, um, that our son and daughter-in-law, our daughter and son-in-law, and their two children worshipped here. That was definitely a plus, and we lived close by. And that was a no-brainer. We visited, enjoyed the sermons, and found a friendly and welcoming group of people, so we joined. What has kept us here? Is it the pastoral staff whose leadership, devotion to the church, and thoughtful, scripture-based sermons send us out each Sunday equipped to face an uncertain world? Well, yes. Was it the choir and music program giving us wonderful, often inspiring music week after week? Think last week's Saints Go Marching In. Yes, again. Or could it be our popular, always full church school? Well, that's a yes. There's our Sunday school, always interesting, always teaching, yes again. Or could it be our church staff, always ready to help, another yes. Or maybe our basketball program, well yes. Or maybe it's our generosity. Westminster gives about 27% of its budget to missions locally, nationally, and abroad. I was on witness and service committee for six years, and I can attest that much study, thought, and prayer goes into every monetary decision we make. So that's a major yes. You get the picture, we still live nearby. Our daughter and son-in-law now have five children, and this is still a friendly, welcoming church. There's no frozen chosen here. Our doors are open to all who want to worship God, and it offers many opportunities for any who want to serve. Of course, none of this would be possible without you, the congregation support. So as you bring your pledge cards today, remember this, it is our church and where it goes, what it does depends on us. <laughs> 